Hello everyone, Gigs here once again for another Project Ozone boss fight. Now today we are here on the Abyssal Wasteland once more and we are taking on Sakoth the Harbinger of Harbinger? Binger? Hmm. Harbinger of Doom. You can laugh at me later for how I pronounce that. Um, from the Dark Realm. So we have to perform a ritual in order to summon him and we need to have all these bits and pieces in place. The biggest issue I had was with liquid antimatter because every time I filled a bucket up it would disappear. So I quickly filled it up and popped it on the pedestal and it looks like it's still full from what I can tell. Um, be still be full because I really want this to work. Um, I'm not sure how difficult this guy is, whether he's going to be easy peasy. I think the last guy we fought in here was hmm, Asgoth, the, dra the green dragon, and he ended up being quite easy. Um, so oh, we'll see what this brings us. Um, so I don't think I needed a sacrifice. No, no sacrifice needed just some energy and we have plenty of that so oh, let's go and see how we manage to get on with this guy oh no we didn't want to do that <laughs> false start let's go no hmm let me think we got the obby got that Got the liquid krillium and we've got the core. Hmm, why are you not working? I'm doing this in the abyssal wastelands. Hmm. What was that Asura one? Yeah, so he's definitely in abyssal wasteland. Liquid Carillion, yep. So I want to pick up the antimatter because it will disappear when I pick it up. Oh, why aren't you working? I'm clicking on you, you should be working. It's Oblivion Catalyst, that's definitely there. It's normal obby. Oh, compressed obby. That's my problem. We don't want compressed obby. Dairy me. Do that. We'll give us normal obby and here we go. So, one, two, three, four and oh here we go here we go oh, what have we got going on here Ooh. i am unleashed feel the wrath of the dark realm mortal are you gonna come at me oh Hello. Not bad back on my sword is good. Did we, did we manage to whack whack whack? Oh yeah, no, we are taking down his health. Knock back on my sword is a little bit much. He seems to be fairly like he is again if you look up in the corner you'll see my shield is every so often taking a little bit of damage but he's, he's not doing too much oh. again I can imagine that if you didn't have good gear on you this guy would just absolutely oh no I don't want you to go in there because I don't want to lose my stuff get out of the pool get out of the pool Ha. 
Was he dying? Or has he made... Oh, he's made lots of friends. No, go away. Ah! I'm going to have to kill his friends so I can get at the loot. Yeah, so again, I think if you had probably lower level gear, even these guys, again, you can see up in the corner that they're attacking my shield like crazy. Oops, and another one. Hard to see. And I don't need you coming along to share in the fun. Thanks. And another one of you. Still more. Hard to see them because they're a little bit invisible. Another zombie getting in on the action. Is that everyone? Have I got everyone? Okay, let's see. <laughs> Firstly, we're not. We can pick all this loot up. I think I've got a soul there too. Let's see if we can pick all this loot up and get rid of some of the stuff we don't need. So, we don't need all that. XP, let's get rid of that obby, we don't need that, we don't need that, we don't need the hearts. Um, I'll hang on to the Shard of Oblivion because they're a pain to get. We've got a Shadow Creature Soul. Sarkos Soul Reaper Blade, Souls Harvested. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Might have to read up what that is. It's got like a counter, 0 of 1024, that may have to go towards something. So we'll definitely check that out. Um, got another. So we've got a shadow creature soul and a shadow monster soul. That's kind of good. We'll hang on to the gem shards. They come in handy for stuff. We don't need the loot bags again. Another shader bag. Is that? I had already had the sheep soul in here before. So that's so much this stuff. Give it, give it, give it, give it. Actually, where's my magnet? That way I can make sure I pick it all up. Make it a bit easier. Easier, easier, easier. That's all the zombie stuff. I have it all floating around me. Let's go back into the trash can. Loot bag, get rid of you. Get rid of you, get rid of you. You, you, you. I think that's everything. So yeah, so basically all we got from him was the sword and the grab bag. All these bits and oh, possibly those shards of oblivion. Um, all these shadow fragments I probably got from killing the shadow creatures that came after him, um, which is again where I would have gotten the souls from. Hmm, so I need to find out um, what that does. A soul reaper blade. What happens if I go and kill someone with it? 30 attack damage. It's pretty good. This thing's a lot more though. You can see it's um, plus 200 attack damage, plus 500 attack speed. So it's um, 500%. So it's quite a oh, 10 knockback resistance. <laughs> plus 10 reach. Yeah, so I mean this is a knockback 5. It's a pretty decent sword, which is why I was able to get rid of him fairly easy. Um, if I had taken him on earlier in the game, I think it would have been just impossible. Let's just see what happens when we kill something with this nifty sword. Should I get a... So I harvested a soul. Come here. Come here. Can you? Um... Yes, yeah, so I'm getting a soul each time I kill something. Now, can you extract those souls, I wonder? Hmm. I am going to have to find out more about that. It definitely seems an interesting thing that you're collecting souls in bits and pieces. Hmm. Yes. But in the meantime, I know that this was a super, super short fight because he was quite easy in the end um but now we have our snazzy new soul collecting sword um but for the meantime thanks a lot for watching the video and until i see you on the next boss fight for the project ozone stuff you have a great day